Okay, this is a case. Alright, um, plot is a, it's a Bristol 2013, and uh, David Jackson is setting out for revenge. This also puts his loved ones and things, loved ones and family at risk. And then the opening scene, we'll see the character, a, a character escaping through the woods, being chased, and then at the end, being shot. And next thing you know, our David. Jackson's getting a phone call and uh, find out he's dead and later on that will link in to the whole main storyline. The cast for our hero we're going to try and cast Jake Gyllenhaal because uh, he's generally typecast to this genre so that will help us bump up the ratings on our film and then he also his, um, his characteristics of being six foot tall and like a soft build and uh, being strong and having the manly stubble um, will help because that generally apparently works, works to female what female look like than men. For our villain, <laughs> for our villain we're going to cast Sam Witwer because um, he, he fits, because of how he fits the role with his personality and her appearance and the fact that it's also intimidating and uh, strong and then uh, the villain is also David's uncle he sets that target everything David does so that adds a bit of a twist to it and our princess is Natalie Portman and then uh, yeah, she fits the role because she's made many, played many princesses in films and she still comes across as a strong woman she, um, she, how she plays in the film is a uh, if she's uh, David's love interest and comes mixed up in some in uh, the whole storyline, making make it harder for uh, David to do his job. So yeah, and now I pass on. Um, the cost for this film is about thirty million. So we looked at Taken, which was twenty five million, and Source Code, which was twenty eight million. We don't need to have something similar. We only spent about ten million on. Captain the action, uh, 15, maybe a bit more, production, and around 5 million on the marketing, like a million on uh, TV, 3 million on like, posters and making a trailer, and then an extra million to um, get it on YouTube and streaming. Uh, yeah, we're going to make a 30 second to a minute trailer, which can be played on TV. Film posters go on billboards, magazines, bus stops, and maybe a banner to put on social networks. And when you go onto YouTube or Twitter, you can just click straight into it. Uh, our film's gonna be similar to the film The Punisher, as uh, it's about an ex cop whose family has been killed, and he has to go and take revenge. Uh, it's also a thriller film due to its strong violence and gore. Uh, our target audience is um, males from 15 and above who enjoy suspense and strange.